Hi, it's Christina. So I heard you're looking for what foods to eat to get clear skin, but maybe you're a little confused about what to eat or you aren't sure what's safe or not. Let me help you because if you're someone who wants the clearest, most beautiful skin with diet, you are on the right track. And if you keep watching till the end of this video, I'll also tell you how you can 10 times your clear skin results. Because believe it or not, there are foods that when you eat them, they can make your skin soft and smooth. And there are foods that can get rid of any skin problem you have, whether that's eczema, acne, or any other type of skin issue. Uh, but the foods that I'm going to tell you about in this video now, these are really special foods. Um, what makes these foods so special for your skin is that all of them help to balance your gut microbiome. I talked about this in my video last week. This is something we're recently discovering. Many studies show that your gut microbiome and what's inside plays a huge part when it comes to your skin. This is called the gut-skin connection and it's the belief that whatever you do inside your body also shows on the outside. So if inside your body is balanced and your inflammation is down, what's on the outside like your skin is balanced and beautiful as well. All the redness, all your skin issues go away. Personally, I agree with this. For me, my skin did not always look like this. Honestly, I used to have terrible skin and I couldn't even show up in a shirt like this before. But I started changing my diet, I started changing my food and my skin got amazing results. So I wanna show you the first food that helps with clear skin. Let me show you. So when my skin was really bad, I started eating this food every week and it really helped me. Uh, so this first food is fatty fish. Now, fatty fish, what you want in fatty fish and how it helps your skin, let me tell you, it's the omega-3 content. Now, have you ever heard of omega-3 for your skin before? And you've probably seen signs of omega-3 everywhere, like on packets of fish especially. Um, that's because omega-3 is an essential fatty acid that really helps your skin by providing those fatty acids to help your skin to repair. Omega-3 can help your skin look soft, it can help your skin look smooth, and it also really helps me when I was struggling with eczema because it helps the inflammation from the inside go down. So, you know, that redness, that swelling, that can go down down when you start to improve your diet and take more omega-3. I love getting my omega-3 from fish. I'm someone that naturally likes fish and there's also just a lot of omega-3 in fish. Um, like I said, when my skin was really bad, I was adding this into my diet every week. And you might be wondering like what I mean by fatty fish. Uh, so there are different kinds of fish. There are fishes that are more lean like tuna and those leaner fish, they're not gonna have as much omega-3 because omega-3 is a fat and that's stored in the fat of the fish. So you want to get the fatty fish like salmon, or if you can't find salmon, uh, you can also look into fishes like cod. You also have fishes like mackerel or sardines, and those will all have omega-3 as well. Sometimes if I didn't have access to fresh fish, when my skin was really bad, I would still try to get the omega-3 in the canned ones. And as long as it's a salmon or a fatty fish that has omega-3 in it, it will be great for your skin. And you know, of course, if you are allergic to fish or you can't have fish, you also also have omega-3 supplements that would definitely help you skin out as well. Let me move on to the next food because that's a whole nother video. Uh, so this next food, I also put this into my diet every week when my skin was having a really bad time and I do think it helped to make my skin clear. Let me tell you about it. Okay, so at some point, I had eczema breakouts on my legs and my arms and this is when I introduced this food. And I made this and I would eat this while my skin had a lot of healing to do. And this food is bone broth. If you haven't heard of bone broth before, bone broth is pretty much just like a soup and you make it from the bones of any animals. And you can find this in the grocery or you can find it already made and you can also make it yourself. It's pretty much just like a soup. Um, if you get it in the grocery, Usually they're gonna have it in like a box or something box like this and you just have to buy um, a really good quality one that says bone broth on it. And if you want something more fresh, you can also make it yourself. Like I said, when I was struggling, I was doing bone broth and eating bone broth 
every week when I was really trying to heal my eczema. The reason I did that is because it is full of vitamins and minerals that help your skin. The main benefit that you're gonna find in this soup is the collagen. And if you don't know what collagen is, I have other videos on that, but collagen is a really important protein that gives you beautiful looking skin and it really helps to build up your skin, especially if you're having problems with eczema, if you're having problems with acne or pimples, collagen can really help your skin to improve. Um, it makes your skin more elastic, it gives your skin more bounce, and it also makes it more firm. Uh, that is the main ingredient that is so good in the bone broth and why I would drink it every week. Adding bone broth to your diet helps you to get more of that collagen and it can help your skin to look amazing and to heal much faster. And speaking of collagen, let me show you another food that goes with it. Um, so if you're doing the bone broth, which is gonna make you look amazing, you also want to look into this food and these are kiwis. I actually got a box of kiwis here that I just picked up at the supermarket, but these are one of the best fruits to get if you're at the supermarket. These are gonna be one of the best fruits for your skin. And I'll tell you why. So kiwis I started to add in because when you're eating foods that boost your skin that have collagen, like the bone broth, um, when you add in a food that has vitamin C, it helps to boost your clear skin results. Uh, so because I was doing the bone broth, I wanted to get more vitamin C in to help boost that effects. And so even, and so that's why I went for kiwis. And I would have kiwis often. They were one of my favorite fruits to have. Even if you're not doing the bone broth, you can still get a lot of benefits from vitamin C from your skin. Um, if you don't know what vitamin C is, vitamin C is a vitamin that helps your skin to be clear. It helps it to be more radiant looking. And yeah, that's why sometimes you'll see it in lotions or even serums for the skin uh, because it helps your skin to become really clear and bright. Uh, but if you eat it or you eat fruit with it or if you eat foods with vitamin C in it, you can also get a lot of clear skin benefits as well. Uh, for me, so I was adding in the bone broth and I started to add in some fruit like kiwis with vitamin C too. If you're wondering how much vitamin C a kiwi has, um, one kiwi actually has almost your full daily value of vitamin C. So if you eat a kiwi or two, you are getting a lot of vitamin C. Um, they're also rich in other vitamins that can help with skin healing. And they also have an antioxidant that protects your skin from the sun damage. Uh, so the next time in your store, you're wondering what fruit can I get to clear up my skin? pick up some kiwis and your skin will thank you for it. Now, when you're at the grocery and you're wondering what food can I get to make my skin look beautiful and clear, another food that's really great, and I started to eat this every single day, are bananas. Now, you might not think of a humble banana as a skim food, but bananas are actually one of the most complete foods for your skin, let me tell you why. So bananas are rich in potassium, which is great for your skin. It actually helps to relax your skin. And if you are struggling with dry skin or flaky skin or eczema, potassium, which is in the banana, helps to promote the hydration in your body. It's actually a what do you call that? An electrolyte. So it helps you to keep more moisture on your skin. Uh, it also, bananas help to reduce inflammation. So if you have redness, you might see it go down by adding bananas into your diet. Uh, another great thing that I like about bananas, and this has to do with your gut health, is that it also has prebiotic fiber in the banana. And prebiotic fiber helps you to balance out your gut microbiome. It helps to feed the good bacteria. Uh, so a banana is kind of like a super food for your skin. Um, you can also find them anywhere. You always have access to a banana. I think I've seen a banana at every single store. For a good snack to clear your skin, just pick one of these up. And here's another food that I want to tell you about. Okay, so now as some of you know from my past videos, I talked about how I stopped dairy products because it was giving me really bad eczema breakouts. Um, but that was a couple years ago and recently I started to think about adding some dairy back in because I started to see studies that said that once your gut, like once you've taken a break from all the bad things, once your gut is repaired and it's healed, it's easier to add some food groups back in again without breaking out. Uh, so this next food I have been trying out Good news, you will be interested to know this. If you still eat dairy or you're looking for a good source of dairy and you want your skin to be better, this food can really help. This one is kefir. So raw kefir is actually great if you have dairy intolerance like me. I'm sensitive to lactose and it makes me break out. So if you're sensitive to lactose, you know lactose makes you break out like me, this is great because it's very low in lactose and you still get all the benefits of dairy for your skin. 
Um, kefir is great. It has probiotics that help you to balance, you know, everything out on the inside, your gut microbiome, so everything that we want. Uh, you also have a lot of minerals and healthy fats, and you have a lot of vitamins in it that also help your skin. And there's actually been a recent study showing that kefir is linked to clear skin. So if you're interested in getting clear skin, you want something to drink, something to put, you know, into your breakfast or to have in the morning, definitely look into adding kefir. Uh, so like I said, I had stopped dairy for a while, but this is something I added back in and it does not make me break out. I actually make my own kefir. I bought grains on Amazon. Uh, I strain it out, I put my own milk in it, and I actually put A2 milk because that makes it easier for people with lactose intolerance, but you can put whatever milk you want in it and you leave it on the counter and eventually it turns into kefir. Um, but you know, if you don't wanna go through all of that, you can just buy it at the store. And that's what I do sometimes when I just don't have the time for, you know, to make it myself. Um, but again, the reason that all these foods work so well is because they promote a healthy gut and bacteria balance for the inside so that your skin balances out and looks good on the outside. In case you're new to this channel, my name is Christina and I help thousands of people get clear skin naturally. And in my videos, I'm sharing how to get clear skin. So if that's something that you're interested in doing, subscribe and turn on the notifications so that you get my latest videos. Now, if you're still watching this, your skin is gonna look great by adding those food in. But if you're still here, I think I wanna tell you how to times 10 these foods and like how to get the most results because you're already gonna go out, you're already gonna get them. So let me tell you how you're really gonna get the most results with these foods because maybe you're dealing with bigger skin issues, right? Like you have eczema, you have really itchy skin. Let me help you because I know what it's like and I wanna show you how you can 10 times your results with these foods because for me, these foods improved my skin a lot, especially in the beginning when I didn't know what to eat. I could safely eat these types of foods and that's why they're gonna be great for you. You don't have to worry about breaking out. That's really gonna help you. You can eat these foods and you can feel fine. Uh, but we still have to deal with the eczema, right? The redness, the itchiness, the breakouts. And for me, when I saw the most results, and this can really work for you, like when I got rid of my eczema, it was when I did a combination. So I combined these foods, like the ones I said, and some other foods too, but the gut healing foods with an elimination process. And that gave me the ultimate edge, I think, with my skin. It really helped me to see results. So. Here is what you do if you wanna times 10 your results with these foods. Eat these good foods, okay? But also get rid of the things that trigger you, the things that make you itchy, the things that are making your skin red. You will get huge results. You will 10 times your results if you do this. Add in the good stuff and take out the bad ones. It is a two-step process. I had eczema since I was a kid. I was eight years old. And after you know balancing everything on the inside and doing what I told you, peeling your gut and then taking out the foods that are in giving you inflammation, my skin cleared up in 30 days, like literally four weeks. I saw the huge change on my skin. Uh, so that's how you can 10 times your result. This is a two-step process. It can work for anyone. I've seen it work for myself. I've seen it work for other people. And if you're wondering how to do this, you should come and join the Flawless community. Um, I post more videos there for anyone who wants to know about how to clear their skin with this natural process. And I know what bad skin is, you know, it's hard. So if you wanna get in, I will leave a link below in my description. I think you'll like what I have to tell you over there. If you've watched this far, thank you so much. I hope this video inspired you to continue to clear your skin with food. You are on the right track and I know you are gonna get results. Um, leave me a comment below if this video helped you tell me what did you do to change your skin with food tell me if diet helped you tell me if food helped you i really want to know so leave me a comment below if you want to keep browsing my clear skin videos here's a good one right over here bye